Hi, my name is Randy Rolfe, and I'm president of the Institute for Creative Solutions. And I want to talk to you today about the very common sense kind of concept um, behind vibrant health and natural living. And uh, this is that we are meant to eat food. And uh, Michael Pollan, who's become a very popular author about diet, and now he has a show called Cooked, um, he says, first of all, eat food. Now, that sounds like, oh, okay, sure, we all eat food. Um, but not really. If your child or grandchild is outside picking up dirt, uh, you don't want them putting it in their mouth, right? You stop them right away. But if you read the ingredients on your uh, regular packaged food, there's all kinds of stuff in there that is not food. It was developed in a chem lab, or if they've taken food and extracted it and fractionated it and altered it with chemicals and electrification and irradiation. Um, these things aren't food anymore. And there's no reason that we should put chemicals that we have developed in our human labs that were never intended, uh, never existed before, to go through our bodies and be used for any purpose in our bodies. So think about that. If you start with real food, your body knows what to do with it. Uh, we've been drinking milk and eating eggs from other animals forever, but not the antibiotics that we add to them, not the artificial um, colorings that we put in the ice cream or the artificial vitamins that we add because we've taken out all the butter, those kinds of things. And then, of course, all the things we make from grain and corn and wheat Endless chemicals are added. None of them are food. Our body doesn't know what to do with them. Our kidneys and our liver have to try to make them harmless. Our skin and our eliminating organs and our lungs try to get rid of them as gas, as liquid, and as oils. Um, we just don't even need to take them in. They're a huge stress on our bodies. So try to start with real food that your grandmother or your great-grandmother would have recognized or some ancient Egyptian could have pulled out of the beautiful Nile silt. So um, that's our message for today about vibrant health through natural living. Just take food into your body and skip all the other stuff that's not food. You'll reduce your stress tremendously, and both physically and actually mentally as well. So go to my website for more resources, www.randyrolf.com, R-A-N-D-Y-R-O-L-F-E. And uh, like whatever you see. Thank you very much.